20 year old Sean Purdy in his hometown court, charged with killing his father in their Pine Grove family home on New Year's Day and then fleeing out of state. The body of 52 year old Lance Purdy found on Saturday, a few miles away in the community of Pioneer, buried in a shallow grave alongside the road. Investigators say Sean Purdy confessed to killing his dad. Growing up, he always seemed like a normal kid. You know, I played soccer with him when I was younger, going through school. He was just your average kid, good student, good athlete. She made Kursar and Sean graduated the same high school class in 2017. It, totally different, you know, he didn't look, his posture was bent over, you know, he didn't look, he didn't look like his normal self, you know, he looked like he had a lot of stuff going on upstairs. An affidavit we got hold of today really gives a clearer picture into why prosecutors believe Sean Purdy killed his father. They say in addition to taking off to Washu County and fleeing deputies, they also believe Sean withdrew the entirety of his parents' bank account. $9,000. The affidavit also explains Lance was going to confront his son, Sean, about substance abuse. His last text message the morning of January 1st saying he believed Sean was home, never heard from again. It's a tough case. It's, it's tough as far as it's a really difficult position for the family to have to go through, and we're going to do the best we can. Deputies also found a suicide note signed by Lance Purdy, but believed to be Sean's handwriting. These past few months have made me incredibly depressed. I have suicidal thoughts due to Sean's recent failures and lack of love. If this is my final goodbye to the family, I want you to know I enjoyed this journey, even though it ended like this. I wish I had done better. They also found another handwritten note with similar penmanship. Two things you should know. I see you. I've been waiting all day to see if you would bust in here. If you take from me, I will kill you in your sleep. I know where you sleep. Walk away now. I'm an honest person. Please don't make me do this to you. Detectives say they also found a Walmart receipt dated the same day Lance Purdy went missing. The items purchased, a machete or saw, shovel, men's shoes, hooded sweatshirt, gloves, jeans, two lighters, camping fuel, and a latch. They also add their surveillance video showing Sean making those purchases. In Amador County, Vicki Gonzalez, KCLRA 3 News.